Chelsea Football Club has secured the signing of 17-year-old forward Estiva William from Palmeiras. Highly regarded in South America, he is known for his skilled dribbling and impressive speed, causing problems for defences in his breakout senior season. Estivao has played 10 times in the Brazilian Serie A, scoring two goals and providing two assists. He has also scored in the Copa Libertadores and Copa do Brasil. Joining other Brazilian players at Stamford Bridge, Estivao has represented his country at youth level. Omari Kellyman is set to undergo a medical at Chelsea before finalising a £19 million transfer from Aston Villa. The 18-year-old forward is likely to sign a six-year contract and join Enzo Maresca's senior squad. Kellyman has played six times for Villa's first team since joining from Derby County in 2022 and is seen as a promising talent. This deal follows Chelsea's previous youth signing from Villa under Todd Burley Clearlake Capital ownership. Barcelona forward Marc Guillou has accepted Chelsea's offer, bringing the deal close to completion. Barcelona did not increase their contract offer to Guillou, and the presence of Vitor Roque and Robert Lewandowski ahead of him influenced his decision. Guillou has informed Chelsea of his acceptance, and the deal is on the verge of being finalised as Chelsea prepares to activate his €6 million Euros release clause. While Bayern Munich and RB Leipzig were also interested, their offers were less appealing to Guillou. Barcelona had offered a new four-year contract worth approximately €2 million Euros per year, but they chose not to increase it, deeming it not suitable for their salary scale. In contrast, Chelsea's offer is three times higher than Barcelona's. Chelsea are in talks with Jonathan David's agent, who is also a target for Tottenham in the summer transfer window. The Canadian international is seeking a move away from Lille, and his agent is actively looking for a new club. David, a 24-year-old striker, has had a decent goal-scoring record in League One, scoring 19 goals in 34 league games last season. While some fans may think Chelsea can do better, he is considered a more proven player than Nicholas Jackson was when he joined the club. According to sources, David's agent has spoken to several clubs, including Chelsea and Tottenham, but no concrete moves have been made yet. Tottenham could be an attractive option for David, as he could potentially become the direct replacement for Harry Kane up front. Former Chelsea striker Dominic Solanke is open to a return to the club this summer. Bournemouth has declined to allow Chelsea to pay Solanke's release clause in instalments. Solanke had an impressive season at Bournemouth, scoring 19 goals in the Premier League and 21 in all competitions. Chelsea should consider bringing Solanke back, as he has improved and could have a positive impact on the team. Chelsea is in need of a striker, and Solanke is one of the options being considered. While negotiations are not advanced yet, there seems to be interest from both parties. Chelsea would need to convince Bournemouth to reconsider their stance. Manchester United have reportedly held talks with Alvaro Morata's agent regarding a potential transfer this summer. The club is in search of attacking reinforcements and is considering a cut price move for the Atletico Madrid forward, who has a release clause of just £10.1 million in his contract. United's net transfer budget is limited to £50 million, and manager Eric Ten Hag also wants to strengthen the team's defence and midfield. Morata, who has Premier League experience from his time at Chelsea, has attracted interest from other clubs such as Roma, Juventus, Borussia Dortmund, and Fenerbahce. The 31-year-old striker scored 21 goals for Atletico Madrid last season. That's all for today's update. Stay tuned for more Chelsea news, transfer rumours. Subscribe now and hit the notification bell.